we're, shots. Hey, Karen Hutton. Hi. Nice to <laughs> see you shots. here at Sutro Bath. Sutro Bath. Yes. Ooh. How? As a voiceover person, how do you like my video voice for these free vid videos? Yeah. I can't really say what I think, can I? <laughs> I wouldn't use that. I wouldn't no? use that voice. No. Okay. No, I'd use Hi. your own voice. Hi, Scott. Hi, how are you doing? I'm good. Yeah. Okay, so for those that uh, suffered through the last couple of videos, <laughs> where I used the funny voice. Yes. Anyways, so you're heading off? I am heading off to go take oh, some pictures. Pictures. Pictures, as Barry Blanchard would say. Pictures? Okay. Darby! Yeah. Put that down! No, but, uh, so what are you thinking? <laughs> no, but really. So what am I thinking? Well, I noticed that uh, Barry Blanchard is set up down here. And I, I don't think he's moving. I think he's here for the night. I think he's here for the for the shot. I think he's what do you think? Is this, instead then, of stressing yourself about running from place to place to place, you just get an easy, accessible location well, if you're shooting and just kind of try it? You kind of have to. You have to just kind of set up. You kind of have to set up and commit. And maybe have a couple places, but around here, I don't think you can. Uh, I don't think you can run around a lot. No. Now, if you do HDR, you can do that. You kind of run around. Okay. But these exposures are long, so I would imagine his exposure is going to be 20, 30 seconds. So he's set up. So, do, so the question is, do yes. I go poach his shot, or do I go find my own? Now, if I want to just torture him just for the heck of it, I'd go poach his shot. How about be in front of his shot? That would be awesome. Be his shot. I could be his shot. So I could do that. Or I could sit up here and claim the superior uh, spot. What do you think about what Lisa Donchek is doing is way she? out there? Wow, she's a thrill seeker. She's going for a whole different kind of shot. She's, now, she's, she's, she's an ultra marathoner. So you're going to see Lisa Donchek doing things like dangling off cliffs, daring the wave to sweep her away. I she, dare you, wave. I dare you, wave. So she'll do things like that. Hey, look, my camera is still there. 15 minutes later. That's awesome. Nice. There's honest people. So yeah, so I'm deciding, do I do, I do long exposure? Do I do HD? I do a combination. Okay. Is the time for socialization done? Is it over? It's getting close. Yeah. Look at that. Look at those colors. Are you uh, maybe to socialize with those that end up standing next to you while you're taking your long exposures? When I really shoot, if I'm really shooting for real, I, I'm like in a zone. I can't even talk. I'm like in this, I'm in this bubble. And so I don't really socialize when I'm really shooting. Mm -hmm. Photo walks, I'm usually hanging out kind of being a jackass. But uh, if I'm really shooting, I, I really don't talk to anybody. I can't. So... I don't know what I'm going to do. It depends on how pretty it gets. How close are you to the perfect shot? How many more minutes is that? It's just 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Well, that's... Well, for the first one, because there's the uh, sunset -y. Uh huh. although this is pretty darn good already. And then there's the post-sunset uh, blue hour afterglow okay. that we'd like to get. So that's what I'm going to do. Okay, I'm going to go get uh, some other people's opinions on what they're uh, shooting you tonight. You do that, Scott Jarvie. I will. And, uh, you have fun, Karen Hutton. Why, well, thank you, Scott Jarvie. Karen Hutton on Google+. Plus. Yes, thank you, Scott Jarvie. Thank you. <laughs> plan. All right, so what are you? what is your plan for shooting right now? I don't know. I'm going to find somebody who's really good and follow them. I follow them? Okay. Yeah. Where are you going? I'm going to do some video, probably a little bit, and at the very last moment... Seriously, are you going to shoot the whole thing with your Galaxy Note 2? From, I think that's an AT&T symbol? Yes. <laughs> Maybe. Wearing your smug mug hat? Oh, people want to see me, right? Yes, they do! Oh, they want to see you! Look at this! Doug K. Hey. hey, Scott Jarvie. Hey, so are what are you focusing on? Uh, I've got the uh, I've got the concrete wall framing the entire. So Michael shot. is ruining everything. He, well, no, he's my model. Okay. Michael's beautiful. He's perfect. Okay. So framing it, you stay stick with this all night. Uh, yeah, I guess the so. one shot. I guess so. Yeah. Okay. It's all, it's all about getting the one shot, isn't it? If you yeah. go in with one good one, you're happy. Okay. Sounds good. Ooh, lots of clickies and things on your camera. I'm back to the cam ranger here. Aren't you Mr. Jarvie? Yes. Scott? Hey. Scott Jarvie. Yes. Pleasure. Nice. Hey, just quickly, what's your focus this time around? Um, right now, Scott, I uh, really like incorporating, I don't know if you can catch that in your video, but if you look, yes, there's look an illusion of a heart shape inside that 
sea stack right okay. there that has always captivated my attention. You know, so I get my timing, make sure I get a nice sunset and occasional Boeing 747. I'm liking this over here. I may come. I, I may come I would, join you. I would incur you to come join okay. me. There's room for you always, Chuck. Sounds good. So here we are. We're using the Cam Ranger again. Looks highly overexposed in that, but don't worry. We're working on it right now. Sounds. Still kind of cool. Love it. Yeah. 